All right, so we have to wait for our bruiser to come back. We're just going to send Sherry in the meantime. <sighs> Here we go. All right, we're going to start with a uh, wooden stool, straight jacket, or newspaper hat. I guess we have to start with wooden stool. All right. There's the Rat King again. Let's go. Whoa, we don't have any rooms we can play, really. Hashtag trash bag. There's a fountain here, a room here. Hey, it's a good fountain, the fountain of knowledge. Uh, the hero starting battle hand size increased by two for the next fight. That's pretty good. Uh, let's put the gold coin here. He's going to pick up the gold first and then go over here for the fountain of knowledge, unless we change that. All right, finally, a room. Uh, no, I need you to... Oh, Lord. Uh, now she wants to go north. I need her to come over here. That's actually pretty good. Let's go down this way. And I mean, we could put this here as well. I think I'm lost. Oh, I, you lost, all right. You lost, all right. Another room here. A dead-end room, actually. All right, how about we do this? We'll put this room here. We got to start throwing down knolls, it seems. I'll put this room here, and then we'll put a knoll here. If we can take out the knoll, then we're ready to go. Knolls are somewhat better than the rat men. All right, nasty rat. Here we go. Bite unblockable. Uh, Ice close punch. And there's claw. Let's block. Block and attack. Battle scars, battle scars. Oh, that's the, that's the what you call the ability we got. Uh, we need to block this. Let's block this. I mean, I can use this. It's they're both the same more or less against the rats. Come on, unblockable. Uh, if it's unblockable, let's go ahead and that's the ice close punch. I was gonna say let's get uh out the way, but we might as well just hold uh. Uh, can't be blocked. Here's lucky hit. Game's over. Go away, you nasty rats. All right, we get a bonus. Guess what line I'm taking, guys? I think I'm taking straight jacket. I think I'm taking straight jacket for once. Actually, uh, Swift's pretty good. I'll take a shift. The ruffled shirt. The ruffled shirt it is. If we use Swift, we get to draw a card. So it'll give us more options. That's pretty good. Uh, let's put this down here. Corridor. Uh, can't really put that anywhere. We can't really put anything else down. How about we go? Let's go ahead. All right. We're going to be doing some fighting coming up. We're going to do some fighting. Here's a rat man. And I think we are good. I think we are good here. I can't really put down rooms anywhere. He's not going all the way back down here for this fountain. Or she, rather. All right, here we go. It's a rat man. Rat man's got... Oh, no. I was going to say rat man's got the advantage on us. Not in this case. Let's bash. So we'll block one, take one, deal one, and headbutt did one as well. Here's bite. It's unblockable. We'll go first, and we'll draw a card. Yeah, yo. And we draw. All right, so we have three eyes closed punch and one lucky hit. Let's get lucky. All right, we just need to deal one. Oh, we don't even need to deal anything. Let's block. Let's block. Ratman will kill himself with the headbutt. All right, so against Ratman, we have the male cult, which is two cards that do nothing, but it gives two health. Here's the cooking pot, which has slam. Uh, they're both unblockable and, and fire blast. You know how much let me some fire blast. And then there's cl uh, uh, club. Two attacks that are unblockable. And rekindle, which deals one damage and heals for one. Deals and heals. Uh, one magic. Let's see. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, these, they both have slam. Let's go club. Let's go club. Oh, man. We're just the greatest adventurer right now. We're going to go one here unless we say otherwise. 
I really don't think we need to say otherwise. Let's go here. And then we're done putting pieces down, aren't we? I mean, we could put a room here. This gave us a, a curse. Uh, I think we're good. I think we're good here. All right, here we go. All right, against the Null. The Null has Fury. All physical attacks deal one damage if on half health or less. So once we get Null down to three health, all his physical attacks will deal one extra point of damage. Uh, it's looking like he's going to get himself there very quickly. Uh, we, let's do Rekindle just in case something comes up. He's going to deal one magic and heal us. Head blow, uh, it deals one physical if it's successful. Uh, we discard, so we're not gonna do that. Uh, neurotoxin, if it's successful, guess what? We're gonna have to throw away a card. Hopefully, we throw away a. Uh, here's Slam. Slam's gonna push him over half health. So, Fury is good to go. Oh man, he's dealing three damage and one to himself. That sucks, because we're gonna use Shift. He's gonna kill himself. Yeah, yo. All right, we would have drawn had had we stayed in battle. Here's Sparkly Headband. Uh, are we ho wearing anything? We're not wearing anything on our head. Okay. The headband's going to give us Holy Seal and Fire Blast. Now, check this out. Had we took the pot last game, or last the last battle we had, if we would have taken the pot, we wouldn't be getting Fire 1. We'd be getting Fire 2. They stack. So this is fire one. If we already would have fire one as a quality, we would get fire two as a quality. Um, here's tattered mail. As you can see with armor one, armor one isn't a card above us because we already have armor one. So we get armor two, which is counter two physicals and one block, one physical block. And then we have stupidity two that stacks as well, which is not good. And then the hook. Hook gives us Swift 1, but we already have Swift 1. So we instead get Swift 2, which is pretty, pretty good. But we lose a lot of stuff as well. I'm going to go Sparkly Headband. Because sadly, it's the only one that's not giving us stuff or taking stuff away or giving us bad things. I'm going to go Sparkly Headband. All right, we're going to fight against the Rat King, right? Yep, Rat King. Unless we find a way to say otherwise. Here's a room. Here's a Rat Man. Oh, no. I should have looked at his abilities. Oh, no. He gets plus one health for each surrounding minion. Now we need to go this way, but now I can't even manipulate it. Dang it. I made the enemy stronger. Always pay attention to the abilities. Always pay attention to abilities. Here we go. Let's get the Rat King. All right. So he's got eight health. He's a leader. He gets one for each surrounding minion, which isn't good. All right. We're going to use Rekindle because we can't block that one attack, but we can heal it. All right, Headbutt's going to deal two to us and one to him. So we're going to block one of those. Actually, let's not. Let's use Fire Blast. Get him down to half health. Anger's going to deal one to us and one to him. We're going to use Shift so we can deal a physical first and draw a card. All right, give us more options. There's Headbutt. Uh, let's... Let's see, if we use Ice Glow's Punch, that's it. We've beaten the Rat King. Yeah, yeah. We leveled up, but that means nothing at the moment. Well, victory, it being such a fine fleeting thing, is often not to be found. Who knows what horrors the future may bring? So cherish it while it's around. All right, we got 96 gold. We got a new battle scar. Attracted to fountains. First tile card each turn has a fountain. Oh, that's, I don't know if that's good or not. I don't know if that's good or not. These are all bonuses we've gained. Trophy room, fire lord, a victimless crime, and goblins. These are three, um, three places we can go, three adventures. All right. All right, so we got the trophy room. I'm going to put the trophy room just beyond the graveyard. Caught up in all this doom and gloom of all the places you've wrecked. It's nice to have a big trophy room. A 
place to quietly reflect. This is the tale of the Rat King. Pretty cool. Oh, we got a bruiser. How nice. All right, we can we can uh we can expand the guild a little bit more. Remember, all these cost fifty. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get the cat uh the hidden den, which is gonna unlock the cat burglar. These are her cards. Oh, she's got cool cards. Okay, she has pounce, which is one physical unblockable. She's got scratch, which is one quick damage. Or one physical, one quick physical damage. Oh, she's got throw cat, which is two physical. She's got two of those cards, and she's got catnip, which deals one physical. Uh, the next physical attack gets one physical damage, which means it gets stacked. It gets stacked. This card does nothing by itself. Once it's put with another card, it does something. So it's not just these cards, but any physical card that we, a uh, physical damage card that we put in our deck as well. That's pretty cool. And it's got the trait covetous, covetous, plus one loot choice slot. Oh, so when we beat an enemy, uh, instead of three cards to choose from, there's four. That's pretty dope. All right, cat burglar, let's go. Uh, the hidden den. We can put the hidden den over here. Up until now, we've all had some fun. And you could say you've come very far. But brace yourself for some woeful cat puns. Now that we have a cat burglar. Meow. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. Oh, we can we can we can expand again, can't we? Let's expand again. What we're gonna do this time instead, we're going to um get these cards, which unlock items in the in the uh the dungeon. Let's see. Can we can we see which ones? This one's pretty. These are pretty good. These look pretty good. Fury, Fury's good. Fire too. You gotta know how much I love me some fire. Yeah, let's go this way. I don't even care what the other ones are. We'll be all right. We'll be all right. Here's a blacksmith. Let's build the blacksmith on the other side of the uh, cat burglar. All right.